Although much of the pre-1960s research in biochemistry focused on the mechanistic modeling of enzymes, Emil Zuckerkandel and Linus Pauling departed from this paradigm by investigating biomolecular sequences as carriers of information. Just as words are strings of letters whose specific arrangement convey meaning, the molecular function, i.e. meaning, of a protein results from how its amino acids are arranged to form a word. Knowing that words and languages evolve by inheritance of subtle changes over time, could protein sequences evolve through a similar mechanism? Could these inherited changes allow biologists to reconstitute the evolutionary history of those proteins, and in the same process, reconstitute the sequence of their ancestors? Zuckerkandel and Pauling in 1963 coined the term paleogenetics to introduce this novel branch of evolutionary biology. sequence dissimilarity between orthologous proteins from model organisms correlates with their evolutionary history as evidenced by the fossil record. A. Average distance tree of hemoglobin subunit beta-1, HBB1, from human, homo sapiens, chimpanzee, pan troglodytes, rat, ratus nervegicus, chicken, gallus gallus, and zebrafish, Danio rario. B. Alignment view of the first 14 amino acid residues of HBB1 compared in A. Residues highlighted in blue are identical to the human HBB1 sequence. C. Timeline of earliest fossils found for different aquatic and terrestrial animals. In 1978, Dayhoff, Schwartz and Orchid contributed to another bioinformatics milestone by developing the first probable istic model of amino acid substitutions. This model, completed eight years after its inception, was based on the observation of 1572-point accepted mutations, PAMs, in the phylogenetic trees of 71 families of proteins sharing above 85% identity. The result was a 2020 asymmetric substitution matrix, table 1, that contained probability values based on the observed mutations of each amino acid, i.e. the probability that each amino acid will change in a given small evolutionary interval. Whereas the principle of, i.e. least number of changes, was used before to quantify evolutionary distance in phylogenetic reconstructions, the PAM matrix introduced the of substitutions as the measurement of evolutionary chain. In the meantime, several milestones in molecular biology were setting DNA as the primary source of biological informa tion. After the elucidation of its molecular structure and its role as the carrier of genes, it became quite clear that DNA would provide unprecedented amounts of biological information.